white line, King City. A city devoted to the glory of God, but in her dark underbelly, there are villains gathering. Evil men who seek to steal God's glory. Will King City find her hero? Can she be saved and restored to her former glory? For the answer to these questions and more, tune in every week to The King City Chronicles. For me, don't start without me. I am on the way. Here we go up to them. Hello, 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 children. It is I, Professor von Hibbel, and I am the head of the King City Scientific Outreach. And my colleague, Dr. Samanex, and I have a special New Year announcement to make. We have been waiting to tell you all this for the new year, only I don't know where Dr. Somenix is. Where is that doctor? Dr. Somenix! I think I hear him. Dr. Somenix, are you... Oh, there he is. <laughs> He's been working hard in the lab. Dr. Somenix? Dr. Somenix? Dr. Somenix! Uh, the sum of the square root of any two sides of an isosceles triangle is equal to the sum of the remaining sides. What are you talking about? Who, me? Science! Okie dokie, well that's good, but uh, we was about to make the big New Year's announcement. All right, the announcement, uh, yes. the message, yes. The message, is, yes. Is, the is message. it in the Bible? It is in the Bible. Oh, all right, I'll get the Bible out right now. All right, now. good, good, good. Oh, all right. Oh, that's so beautiful. Good news. Like a lullaby. Good news. Dr. Samanex. Dr. Samanex. Dr. Samanex! For every action, there's an equal but opposite reaction! What is that about? Just science. Well, hey, let's read the Bible. Oh, good idea, yes. All right, now, kids, it is important to know that at this time in the Bible, the, the, the Jewish people had been waiting for hundreds of years for God to send them their king and savior. Oh, boy, they must have been really old. No, the same people weren't standing around for hundreds of years. I mean, the Israelites, the Jewish people, they had been waiting for generations. A long, long Long time. Oh, that waiting around must have made them really tired. Mm. <laughs> Dr. Samanex? Dr. Samanex! A equals MC squared! That's science. That's you science. really need to get more sleep. Oh, okay. No, not now. Not oh. now. We're in the middle of a story. Oh, okay. Okay. Now, the prophets had promised a savior would come and to save all of Israel. And then... Silence. <gasps> science! No, not science. Silence. Oh, silence. Nothing until Jesus! Wow. <laughs> and then some people recognized their king. What king? Jesus! Oh. The savior and king. Oh, yeah, but they weren't expecting that kind of king, so who recognized him? Well, to begin with, Simeon and Anna. Uh, cinnamon bananas? <laughs> Not cinnamon bananas. Oh. Simeon and Anna. Oh. What were you thinking about? Well, science, mostly, and... And lunch. Uh, so who were Simeon and Anna? Well, Simeon was a godly man uh -huh. who was led by God's Holy Spirit. And God had promised Simeon that he would not let him die before he saw the Savior. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> yes, Jesus, exactly. Yes. And one day, the Holy Spirit moved Simeon to go to the temple. And on that very same day, Mary and Joseph brought baby Jesus to be dedicated to the Lord. Oh, wow. It's too bad Cinnamon didn't meet him. Simeon. Yes. And he did meet him. In fact, he held baby Jesus in his arms and he said, My eyes have seen your salvation. Oh, wow. What did Mary and Joseph think? Oh, they were amazed because Simeon told them all of the great things that Jesus was going to do. Now, also, in the same temple, there was a prophetess named... <gasps> Banana! No, Anna. Oh, Anna, Not yes. Banana. She was a lady prophet. Do you know what a prophet is? <gasps> Anything over 10%. You're not going to make this easy, are you? Nope. 
Okay, a prophet is a person who hears from God and then tells others what he has heard oh. and what God said. The prophetess Anna also recognized that Jesus was the one God has sent as Savior and King. Oh, of course, that makes a lot of sense. Simeon and Anna both believed in God, and yeah. so they were able to recognize Jesus. <gasps> Good night. No, wait, 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 that's not the end. Oh. Wake up. You have to hear about the Magi. What's a Magi? Well, you probably know them as the wise men that followed the star to find baby Jesus. Oh, yeah. And they recognized Jesus as the king of the Jews. But that was e even obvious to bad guys. <gasps> what bad guys? Where? What oh, bad guys? Oh, none here, just in the Bible. Oh. Yes. Well, King Herod was one of the bad guys. He was the Roman king at that time. And listen to what the Bible says. After Jesus was born in Judea, during the time of King Herod, Magi from the east came to Jerusalem and said, Where is the one who has been born king of the Jews? Oh. We saw his star in the east and have come to worship him. Oh, so that's why they brought him gifts to worship him. Yes, but listen to this part. When King Herod heard this, he was disturbed, oh. and all of Jerusalem with him. Why was King Herod disturbed? Well, he felt threatened. You see, he was the king, and he did not want any other king, even one sent from God, to take away his throne. Oh, but Jesus wasn't the king who wanted crowns and riches. Jesus is the king who wants our hearts. Exactly! <laughs> <laughs> we should tell the whole universe about our king. <gasps> Dr. Somenix! You just gave me a brilliant idea! I did! Are you sure it was me? Yes, yes! We should tell the whole universe all about the king, and I know just how to do it. We'll use Skylab Omega. Remind me what that is again. Skylab Omega? It's only the project that you and I have been working on for the last several years. Yeah, that. <laughs> yes, that. <laughs> Skylab Omega, kids, is the most spectacular spaceship that we have ever created. And we've got the greatest space pilot ever to command her. His name is Commander Cosmos Space Ranger. <laughs> well, hey, let's go get it ready. Oh, another great idea. All right, kids, we'll see you next time. But until then, remember, Jesus is the same yesterday, today, and forever. Salam.